You got clutch. What's going on, people? It's your main man, Johnny Clutch Cards, aka Johnny Clutch Crypto, back again with another, you know, D5 video. This is one of the projects that we've been looking at and we have invested in. Uh, we invested in V1. We did make profit. We skipped V2 because it's a little bit shady, you know, the back and forth that was going on in the project itself. And then we got in on V v3 i think the second day after it started so i think v3 began on the 14th of this month right um and i think we invested on the 15th of this month and here we are on the 27th um and v3 is over right so v3 has ended because there is now zero Matic in the contract balance, all right? So if you have invested money in stable one, um, you're probably at zero. Uh, even if you invested on the first day, 314, you probably didn't get your money back, right? Because that's, you know, uh, it ended yesterday. So that would have been 12 days from the 14th to the 26th. That would have been 12 days and, you know, just rough math at 8% daily, uh, you know, to get, to get there, you probably need about 14 days, right. To, to get back, to get to a hundred percent or more, even if you're, and then even if you're, um, even if you withdrew daily, which means you took out the 8% every day, once it got to 8%, you took it out, right. It reinvests 21%. So let's round it down to 20, right? So 20% of eight is like what 1.6, right? Which means you're getting you're in, you're getting back 6.4% a day, right? But then it increases your reinvestment, right? Your reinvestment is increased by that small percentage which makes tomorrow's 8% a little bit bigger, right? So really you need more than 12 days. You definitely need more than 12 days, right? So even if it's, you know, 14 days, or 15, you know, 14, 15, 16 days, somewhere in there, right? To get your money back, to get back to even. That's before you even start making profit. So really, um, and listening to the AMAs and the information that's been put out by the team and been put out by the Discord and the uh, creators, sorry about the, the Discord dinging in the background because I do want to be able to reference some of the information in the Discord in this video. Um, that's how it's supposed to work. So basically, this is supposed to be a Ponzi. It's what it's supposed to be, right? But the idea is that the Ponzi is supposed to last longer because people are supposed to be confident in the project of this ROI project. That's what they call it, an ROI project. Um, and they got other things going on, like they got a DEX and they got another token, the S rocket, and they got NFTs and all this other stuff. But this is their initial offering. So it's like if McDonald's made a poor hamburger, then why would you want their fries? Why would you want their drinks? Why would you want their other sandwiches? Right? If you can't do the first thing that you're doing correctly or make adjustments to it properly, why would I want anything else that you're serving? So I say that to say this. In V1, there were some problems with the contract. Some people got their money locked up. They, you know, went above and beyond to try to make people whole and things of that nature. But they didn't fundamentally fix the ROI project, right? Most ROI projects or investments means that I'm giving you my money to invest it or I'm giving you my money to make money and that's where that's where the return comes from. That's where the ROI comes from. This ROI is purely based on people continuing continuing to invest in the project. So people who are in early get paid off of people who come in late. That's the whole thing. That's it. That's all that's there. 
And it's supposed to work like that. That's what these guys tell us. So I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't know about the other stuff that Stable One has going on. They say that they're going to uh, let's look, look, dear members. Firstly, I'd like to thank you all for sticking by Stable One as a brand and being supportive over and over again, suckers. <laughs> Secondly, as per community votes, and and when I say suckers, I'm included, right? Because I invested twice. Secondly. As per community votes, we will be launching V4 of Matic on Tuesday with different matrices. 10% a day. So they have been able to pay the 8% a day on any kind of, you know, more than, you know, this time more than 14, uh, 13 days. Uh, my bad, 12 days. They couldn't pay 8% more than 12 days, but now they're going to pay you 10% a day for 21 days with withdrawals every 48 hours. Thirdly, we will be we will be launching the bot program in the next 10 days for stable passive income between 1 and 2% per day. They always got like something else that they're trying to do in addition. It makes no sense to me. When you can't do the first thing that you're doing correctly, why would I want to participate in other things that you're doing? It makes no sense. Having said that, we are giving our community various different platforms to invest and make passive income. Some like high risk, high rewards. Others want stable passive income. We as devs are giving you various options to choose from. So you can invest in a Ponzi or they have some type of passive income thing coming. So, I mean, we'll see what, what happens with this particular project, but, you know, let's see what else they say. We listened to our soldiers, now we're reducing our death fees. Oh, great. They're reducing their death fees. Good for them. Um, I, I just don't know how, particularly after this, you know, v, V3, because in V3, I don't think anybody made any money. And if they did make money, it's very... It's highly unlikely that anyone made money in V3. So at least in V1, some people made money, right? It was new. Nobody really understood it. They had problems with the contract, so forth, so on. People aped in, da 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 da. So less people ape in in V2. V2 goes 20 days, I think it was. Maybe it was around 20 days in V2. And then here in V3, 12 days. 12. 12 days. I mean, if we go here and look at the Polygon scan on the contract, let's refresh this. All right. So last uh, withdrawal attempt was 56 minutes ago. But people are still trying to get their money out, right? But then the thing that I thought that was kind of unique was that there's still some, some people investing. So they haven't even turned this contract off to stop letting people put their money in here. Somebody put 1.4 Matic in. Somebody put 0.4 Matic in here. Not a lot of Matic. Not a lot, but still. I think within the last 24 hours, they let somebody put in 235 Matic. That's irresponsible. So if it's dead, then it's dead. Let it be dead. Shut it off. Shut it down. But these are the types of things that make you question people's... Uh, Scruples, like whether you know, you know, they, they say the right things in the AMAs, and they're very apologetic, and and they uh, 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 proposed a, attempts at making things right. But you let this guy put sixteen Matic in three hours ago. This thing's been dead since yesterday. Things it's been dead since yesterday, but you still got people putting money into the contract, and they can't stop it, or they can't shut it off as devs. Come on, man. What's going on? 75 Matic four hours ago. 75 Matic. Now, who knows? You know, maybe that guy has a million Matic and 75 is nothing to him. But maybe 75 Matic is all he had to invest. So just looking through, you know, some of these pages here, man, like, you know, they, they got to do better than this, man. It doesn't. It doesn't even make any. This doesn't even make any sense. So until further notice, man, I, I like you know. I, I said like invest at your own risk. You know, this is obviously not financial advice. 
However, I would say stay away. I mean, if you if you like if you like making money, this is probably not the thing for you. Because this is sketch, to say the least. Like it just is. It's just sketch. You know, anything where I may or may not make money. <laughs> you might make money, you might like all DeFi projects carry risk, but this is extra risky because in essence, from V1 to V3, they haven't changed it. It's the same thing. Everybody put their money in the pot and we're going to pay 8% or 7% and now 10%. But there's no, there's, we're not doing anything with the money. Like it's just going to sit there and as long as there's money in there, it'll pay out until there's no money in there. So I, I want, I'm probably going to take a deeper look at the contract overall just to see you know what happened toward the end like when it was actually drained is are there any like large withdrawals um and then try to look at some of the larger accounts or look at those accounts to see if they actually invest in matic and that there's no funny business going on there but you know just taking them at their word that you know this is just a natural progression like 12 days is is not is not enough days for anybody to make their money back if they're getting if you're investing uh, if you get an 8% back on your investment on a daily basis. So that being said, I mean, I would say until further notice, man, just stay away from stable one. If you can, um, don't be suckered in. They're going to offer you 10%. They probably offer you 20% next month or actually next week because the V4 will probably die faster than V3 did. Um, and then that being said, I don't know about the rest of the other, the, the other things today that they, the other, uh, portions of their ecosystem that they're trying to build out i just know that this is their introductory piece and it's trash so that's my personal opinion you know that's the, you know i don't speak for anybody other than myself and once again this is not financial advice it's just me and my personal experience with stable one so v1 i did make some money v2 i totally skipped it because i saw the writing on the wall um, V3, I, I said, well, let's get in early and see if, you know, maybe they fixed it or tweaked it or anything. No, it's the same thing. It's the same thing. And if I could, let, let me, let me connect my wallet so we can just kind of validate this. Right. So I connect my wallet here. Uh, I, in my early video, I invested 45 Matic to start with. So now my total invested is 63 cause I was taking out my 8% on a daily basis. My total withdrawal. It's thirty nine thirty five, which sounds pretty good because it sounds like maybe I only lost six Matic or five Matic, right? But in actuality, right, this is what I withdrew the thirty nine, but my total reinvestment was eighteen, which is weird, right? Because thirty nine and eighteen, that's like fifty percent, right? So like fifty percent of my withdrawal was actually reinvested in the contract. When in actuality, you're paying out 20%, right? But I guess as a group, I don't know. That, that just seems weird to me. And if you, do the, if you do the math, you're talking about 39 right here, 18 here. You really, we really only got about 18 back. So out of 45, um, we got 18 back. So that's still somewhat of a, that's still a considerable loss. If you take that, if you take my 45 mag and you multiply it by 100 or 1,000, which you know, some people probably actually did invest large amounts of Matic into this contract. Um, you could have lost uh, a lot, a lot, a, a lot of money in uh, only 12 days. So that is the video. Let me know your thoughts below. Did you invest in V1, V2, V3? Will you invest in V4? I won't be investing in V4. So this will be this is this will be our sayonara video for Stable One. Um, although we will continue to monitor the project to kind of just see what happens. Maybe they turn it around. Maybe they fix something. Maybe they actually do something with the money that's invested in the contract and turn it into an actual investment. I have no clue what they're going to do or what they will do. But what I know I will do, I won't be investing. And what I really need you to do is to like, share, and subscribe. Subscribe to the channel. We're trying to get up to 1,000 uh, subscribers by May. That'll be our anniversary. We'll be doing giveaways, things of that nature. Uh, anyway, I appreciate all the support. I am your man, Johnny Clutch Cards, a.k.a. Johnny Clutch Crypto. I am always for the people, by the people. You only got me and the Constitution. Remember that.